we're going to just not go over there since there's not a whole lot I can do. Fighting the blades is actually a little bit difficult, unknowingly. Though, uh, I could, I could straight up assassinate her. Um, we, we could, we could do that. I mean, it wouldn't be, wouldn't be the worst thing ever, ever. <clears throat> I mean, I could just, you know. Wait, didn't somebody have, didn't somebody have dynamite? Asking for a friend. Ah. Uh, we can rock plastic explosives. Or no. Plasma grenade, maybe. I think... I think it's gotta be something primable, though. We'll go for... Two minutes. I wasn't really planning on using this on you. But you know what? It's fine. Ian, dark meat, everybody, get over here. I mean, if, if you die, then you die. I don't, I don't really care, honestly. It doesn't matter to me too much. Ian, why is Ian, like, so broken here? I'm gonna zone change. Ah, there we go. Now he starts showing up. And, uh... I'll wait ten minutes. Is everything fine? Is everyone okay? Has anything- Oh no! What happened? There's a dead body here. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> couple de- Couple dead bodies. Rest, rest in peace, you. You just- Oof. <laughs> it's a bit easier this way, yeah? That just sucks I had to use a plastic explosive. It wasn't meant for you. I had- I had a plan. I can buy more. Or find more or something with me. I'll, I'll get one more. I had a plan for it though, damn it. Yeah, well. It kind of sucks taking the easy route though of just like going through this way. Knowing that the regulators are the shitty ones. Oh. Uh. We'll just not do a single damn thing here at all we'll just leave we'll just leave we're just not doing anything here for a bit that's fine what day do we got the 22nd a few more days we could take a caravan up to uh lost hills and poke around there a small group of gangers attack ian ian okay Ian's to the top right. Okay. You first. Damn it. This fight's going well so far. It's going really well. How do you manage to hit dog meat instead of the raider? You aiming for the dude's feet or something? Or... Like, you're not hitting me. Ah, go for the leg. I don't know why I bother. I, it's, I got too much X come in my blood. These 95% chances to hit. Just, just fail them. Every time. Well, I'll take your rifle to sell. Damn. And a sludge. And that reminds me. Let's read this damned thing. Okay. Still working my way up. Uh, what day do we got? It's the 24th. We still got a few days. 
but I'm working my, well, my way up and we'll see about getting caravan up to Lost Hills since I can't go there. I can go there on foot, but you can't really... Oh my god, really? Uh, you can't really do a whole lot. Small label that reads, Property of Area 51, return if found. Hmm. And some bones. And bones. There's the fuzzy painting. Image of a singer. Obviously very old. The image has a felt coating and that is still in good condition. Sure. Yeah, there we go. Alien blaster. Strange gun. Of obviously alien origin. Looks like it can support small energy cells, however. Minimum strength, too. Um... <laughs> this feels very odd. <laughs> <laughs> One of those just random events. Um, quite lucky that we got this, honestly. Yeah, 30 to, 30 to 90. I mean... <laughs> yeah, I don't want to. I want to, though, but I don't want to. I'll hang on to it, maybe. I might hang on to it. If, if we get frustrated and I just need something dead... Then, then maybe. <laughs> uh, shit. Uh, no, I need... I need to wait a bit longer. Just kind of patrol within the city limits so we don't get another random event while I wait. Remind boy message. Water supply is running low in Vault 13. Find the water chip quickly. I believe a hundred days remain then. It's all right. Sign up for another. Short. 400. We'll go Brotherhood of Steel. Heading straight through the mountains. Should be a blast. Bam. And we're there. Paladin. And Cabot, initiate to the Brotherhood of Steel. Hello, and welcome to the Brotherhood of Steel. May I ask your business here? Uh, I would like to join. That's great. Uh, wait, wait here a second, and let me see what you need to do. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. uh, Well, I, I talked to the High Elder, and he said that not just anyone can join. He uh, said you have to complete a quest first. Actually, maybe you can do this without the caravan. I don't remember. At least we got paid to show up here, though. <laughs> Take 400 hub bucks. I don't mind. You have to go to the ruins of the Ancient Order. That's south of here. Uh, you've got to go inside and bring back something that proves that you were there. This place is high-tech. There's things inside like you've never seen before. Oh, uh, it's also radioactive. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll do it. What? You will? Great. Just bring it back here. <laughs> Good luck. Yeah, thanks. I can't believe it. They're sending him down there. Uh, yeah, no, okay. Well, here we are. Here's your payment of 400 caps. Pulls out an old dog-eared money bag and gives you the money. Another 400 if I return with us to the hub. We'll rest here for a while, but don't go too far. The caravan will leave without me. Right. Brotherhood keeps it themselves for the most part. A lot of people give them a, a bad rap, but from what I can tell, they're good people. A little fanatical, maybe, but good guys. Okay, I'll take a look around. Um, I think they marked it on our map, I believe. It's The Glow, I think it's called. Yeah, The Glow. Which, yeah, off that away. So you know what? It works out pretty well still. We can go. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay. Who do we got? That's Ian. Raider, 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 and then us. Okay. You there. Into the eyes. Six. God damn it, dude. <sighs> the fucking damage we deal? I don't I don't get it. Like I don't understand damage at this with this game at all whatsoever. It's just it's either one extreme or the other. Usually I'm using, like, automatic stuff, so even if it rolls kind of low, it still rolls sort of high. But man, just like one shot with the Magnum, you start to really notice when you get those low rolls. Oi. 
What are you doing attacking Ian anyway? Ian? Ian, you okay over there? You just did you just rob Ian? Ow. Holy shit, we're getting our ass beat. Can I can I get a turn? Ian died. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> getting her ass kicked by these dudes. One more. Okay. Cause yeah, I feel like uh Like, it's just, it's the armor-piercing stuff, this, I guess, right? Like, I don't think this has an armor-piercing variant. Like, it just is armor-piercing. And because armor-piercing, I was told, is a bit iffy in this game. Uh, maybe, maybe that's the problem here. Like, this, this only does armor-piercing, though. So... I'll, I'll need to, uh... Get off of Ian, the Magnum with normal ammo, I suppose, and we just... we don't use this after all. I think this... I think this gun was a big mistake. Out of ammo for the shotgun. What? Dude, did you, like, even bring any ammo? Come on now. Well, yeah, and you got the hollow point stuff. I'll, I'll heal while I'm here, too. Sucks about Ian, but you know what? It is what it is. I don't I don't really mind too much. <laughs> I want my gun back off of him and all the ammo anyway, which. Yeah, stable seven hit points, which still ain't much, but maybe that was genuinely a low roll. But yeah, if I use like the standard Magnum, it should also be noted, this is just the, the SMG, which is pretty weak, to be fair. I might- I might die here, honestly. Oh, thank god, dog me doing some work. Okay. So these two still. Yeah. Go for an aim shot. In the eyes with our staple gun. 30. Crit him, 30. Caused blindness, unlikely for him. Okay, so it actually tells you that it causes blindness. If I cripple the eyes, maybe that's not blinding them. Maybe maybe that's not good enough. I'll be over here. Go, Brahmin, go! You can do it! No, stop! <laughs> stop hitting me! Go, go for the Brahmin! Just generally the head. Six. Well... Because this, this I can maybe buy, just doesn't do much damage. 5 to 12. Fair enough. 12 to 22, though, with the AP ammo. Eh. I'm thinking, though. Poor Ian. Dude never stood a chance. I'm at my max capacity. Eh, shit. Had to drop a few things to make it work, but I got my magnum and all of its ammo back. Um, we're good to go. Oh, wow. 400 caps. Yeah. And then while I'm here, I'd like to offload kind of everything. That really sucks about Ian dying, but I think now I can get another follower. Because it was mentioned that Katya is actually a free follower that you can get. Requires no worker effort. Didn't know that. So I suppose there's that. I would like Rad Kiering. I would like a couple more ropes because I don't remember how many I need. Uh, I think I'll pass on the radio because I can fairly easily get another one. And they're kind of heavy, aren't they? I think they're like five or six pounds, which for me is a bit of a problem. But I don't I don't want any of this anymore. 
I'm, I'm done with I don't want to think about it. I don't want to talk about it. Uh, motion sensor, Geiger counter. The Geiger counter I'll hang on to, I suppose. Just for funsies, we're going to be going into a radiated area soon. The fuzzy painting doesn't sell for a whole shell load. Uh, this obviously does. <laughs> Yikes. Can have all of that, and then also armor piercing magnum ammo. I guess I don't have any of that. Okay. So we're looking at uh, a bunch of money, though. A bunch of money that you don't have. I... I guess I can take more stim packs. <laughs> Just all of them. All the stim packs ever. I think that I hang on to for a moment. Mm, the wrench... I want to say I could use the, the crowbar to pry stuff open. So that's what I'm hanging on to with the ropes I'm going to be needing in a moment. I think I just need two to three, but I'll I'll bring a little extra. I don't mind too much. Psycho, I won't be using that. The buff out either, I, I won't be using that. And that already, uh, already does some stuff to him, eh? Hmm. Another rope? <laughs> Guess I will take the radio after all. I guess I Is this is this a spare? Not sure if that's a spare. You need 300 more bucks. I can float that. Here you go. Roughly 300. 314, 305. That's pretty fucking close. Fuck me, I gave him a little bit extra. Because I'm a nice guy. That is an extra one, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Hmm. I... Yeah, no, I'll just I'll just sell that. That's fine. So now how are we doing for inventory space? Total weight 202. Out of 250? That ain't that great. Yeah, those, those don't weigh any... I guess, uh, this rifle ammo. You, you want the rifle ammo? Take it. That's like 16 more pounds. The knuckles I sometimes use, I'll pretend. Um, <laughs> probably never get to get around to using them. Mentats I'll keep, just in case there's a really tricky speech check or something we gotta make, because my charisma is kind of garbage. So if it ever comes to us having to convince somebody of something, I'm gonna have to drag myself up a little bit. Okay. I'll take all the money you've got. And I'll take a mentat off the table. I'll take them both off the table. That's that's pretty close. Okay. Now how we doing? Man, am I done with this guy yet? Done the 186. That's that's feeling a bit better. We got a good 70 pounds or so. Good, good, good. I wish these ropes weren't so heavy. Man, 10 pounds. That's, uh... Annoying to carry around, if I'm entirely honest with you. I'd like to not. So the glow. Yeah, that's... that's down there a bit. We got a bit of an encounter. I was just about to stop and save. Thankfully, it's just red scorpions, though. We can manage that. Right in the eyes. An entire eight. It's still not that great, but you know what? It's better than five and six. Uh, man, go dog me, go. Holy shit. <laughs> Two turns in a row, you kidding me? I will do just a normal shot. And then a switch. And then I'm gonna punch ya. Right in the brain. It's easier to hit the brain than it is the carapace. Is that a little bit odd to anyone else? Shoot it in the brain. Crit for 20. If it was a human, 
you would swear it's pretty pissed off. Yeah, when I get shot in the brain, I tend to get a little ornery too. And no, I can understand that. We can turn these into antidotes. No, I'm not going to though. You kidding me? Hell no. Gross. So let's come to the edge and then we'll save here before we fight something really annoying. Because, uh, well, down here might be okay, actually. I thought that was the glow. Oh, that's going to be Necropolis, the glows. Yeah, the glows way the fuck down there. Right. Okay, yeah, no, keep, uh, keep going. I think we still got time. Still have a few, few months left until like May or so. Place is so far away. Yikes. The second part of the game, by the way, I always must remember, and last time I did a Let's Play in this game, I think I made the same mistake. Um, you, I'm taking damage from poison. Oh, yeah, but I would have been healing up just as quickly. It's fine. Um, am I okay just to, I might be okay just to enter in like this. Large dose of radiation walking in. That's fine. Can only be used from the interface bar. Yeah, well. I'm using it the other way. Twenty-eight. Guy counters off. Fifty-six. Am I like actually getting radiated over and over and over again constantly all the time? I think I might be. So this is for before exposure. 50 and 38 resistance. Lost 25 current. Still radiated though. Yeah, I think I think I made a bit of an oopsie. Yeah, no, let's wind it back a minute. I do want to stop just outside. I didn't realize it would just continuously proc radiation over and over and over again. But the second part of the game, I'm always under the impression that you don't have much time for that. But the original version of the game, 1.0, that I played when I was really young, uh, the time limit was tricky to manage. But in the patch version of Fallout, oh god, there's a combat. It's just a bunch of rats. Dogmate! Dogmate, help! Uh, in the patch version of the game, though, you actually have like 13 years or something insane for the second part of the game. So it's not nearly as bad. Like, at all. So... It could be I quickly do the water chip thing to get that done with, so we can get into the second part of the game and get a bunch more time, and then we can kind of fuck around a little bit and do other stuff and things. Because I'm, I'm always used to the old days where you didn't have much time for that either on the second part of the game, so you, you kind of always have to just go, go, go. So, just to check, we are not radiated. No problem. Gain a bit of rad resistance. And then head on in. The glow. So we still have 100% radiation resistance, and that'll last a little while. So we don't have to worry too, too much. But welcome. The crater. Remains of loser. <laughs> Thought it said laser at first, like, ah, oh, cool nickname, laser. I don't know how we know that, but no, it's, it's loser. And this one as well. Some other loser. Not even a pathetic loser, just loser. Which, you know what, I guess that says something about the people who are pathetic losers. They're even less than these dudes who are burnt to a crisp outside of the crater. Nothing to investigate, huh? Uh, I'm pretty sure... Yeah, okay, here we are. A beam. Strong beam. Stationed over the crater hole. We need a rope. We use rope to descend into this 
a few times, I believe. And we're in. Looks kind of like a vault. Don't think there's any enemies on the first couple levels of it, but we can use another rope to descend further down. And uh, the further down we go, the better stuff there is. I don't know if we can make it all the way, but I'll give it a shot. For now, nuclear blast must have done this damage. For now, we'll see what we can find. I think what I'm after is maybe right there on this armored dude. Corpse encased in odd armor. Nothing out of the ordinary. Lux dead. Hmm. Yeah, don't say. Hmm. A little bit of rat away. Don't mind if I do. I'm currently immune, but much appreciated. What's the Geiger counter say? Okay, so that's reading how much radiation I've got, not the surrounding area. I thought it was the surrounding area and it'd be kind of fun to see how much there was. That's why I kept it. Not really for me. I don't care how much I've got. I can just check the character screen and see if I have any. See if I have any. We, uh... Seem to have some traps. I'm... I'm glad I've got the perception to see it. It's only four. I thought it was worse than that. No, don't get me wrong. Four perceptions. Not good. <laughs> it's, it's not good at all. But, uh... I thought it was better than that. You know? Alright, I'll take it. I was gonna say, you know what? I'm not gonna take that because, uh... Inventory space, but... Yeah. Alright, so what's the deal with the door? Does the elevator work here? Take it really slowly in case of more traps. Sometimes you can see the trap ahead of time and you can try to disarm it. Mild shock from the electric field on the door and take a point of damage. Well, okay then. Noted. We'll move on. Yeah, super broken computer. A little difficult to see, but I'm not seeing anything in that room. I don't think there is anything really super great on the first floor. The next floor, not really either. Like, as, as we get, like, deeper in... I think we can get new armor here. I think at the very end, but I don't know if I can make it that far. But again, I think I'm thinking of something in Fallout 2 as well. <sighs> Fallout 2, there's a place that you... You can go into it kind of early? Dogmeat senses there's, there's a trap near. Dogmeat can sense traps. Where? Where do you see it? Is it the door, maybe? Is the door the trap? Looks like a standard vault door that has been damaged, perhaps burned. Still functional, however. Alright, well, good job, dog meat, spotting a trap. I just, uh, I have no idea where it is. I think it's the door. I think the door is the trap. 26% trap skill. It's not great. Fail to find any. Three, four. We'll try a few more times. Okay. You can go into a place in Fallout 2 kind of early, but if you do that, you just get completely owned. <laughs> it's it's actually like kind of a late game thing. Brass knuckles, tools, another motion sensor, and a massive big book of science. All right. And this locker? Hunting rifle. Ooh. Well, free hunting rifle, I suppose. 
saw rifle and a 14 millimeter pistol. Hey, we got it back. Joy, just in case we. Ow, I found the trap. Dog mate. Ow, that hit for 10. Uh, just in case we change our mind and actually want that back. A yellow pass key. And this seems strange. You think that it may be what the Brotherhood sent me to retrieve. That's it, that's all. But I want to see more. I'm here for the long haul. Brotherhood tape was one pound. I used it. Did we get any info on it? Oh god. Oh Jesus. I guess pause and read this if you would like. And then there's the ending of it. That that's a bit. I think that's the uh the general rundown of what this area is though. And basically saying, hey look, another one. God damn it, I'm so glad I bought that. Um basically saying that this place is radiated as all hell. And uh Radiated. And general... General badness is here. But, then we have a computer here. Hello, computer. Primary power offline. Secondary power online. Power management. Primary power. Reinitialize primary power. Error. Primary system initialization failed. Emergency power then. Disable emergency power. Sure. So now the elevator might not shock us anymore, right? I think that's the general... general thing. Inoperable. It seems to need power. So we need the key card then, I guess, or we get shocked. Fine. Ugh. 